Hey guys, hey chosen generation, hey beautiful people of the most high God. How are you guys doing on this Sunday evening? It's Sunday. It's Sunday evening, guys. Yes, it is Sunday evening. And you as you see, I'm in the car. I am enjoying my Sunday. Yes, I am. I hope you guys had a great day today. I hope all is going well for you today. I pray that every desire, every need is being met in your life. And I know it is according to his riches and glory by Christ Jesus. Amen. Welcome, guys. Welcome to all of my subscribers. Welcome. Let me give you a hug. Mm, that's a hug from me to you and a kiss. Mm, welcome, welcome, and welcome. Welcome to everyone that is even viewing. Welcome. My name is Nee, and on this channel, I give you whatever the Holy Spirit gives me, a word of encouragement, a prophetic word, a scripture, whatever he gives me, I give it to you. So welcome, welcome. Guys, I tell you today, the Holy Spirit, and I'm not going to be before you long. I just wanted to come on and let you know the Holy Spirit was dealing with me about how we, a lot of times, as the body of Christ, can help people. Um, it could be something that is very, very small as far as, well, spending time, uh, you know, giving a hand uh, here and there. And we may hear from time to time, this one uh, and the family needs help. That one in the family needs help. This one, uh, a friend needs help. Uh, or a friend of a friend of a friend needs help. You know, um, the Holy Spirit was wanting me to come on and say that whatever way that we can help people, that is also planting seeds. Um, I know sometimes we say, well, well, I'm busy. I got things to do. I got my own stuff I'm dealing with. But um, if it's something that you can do, whether you have your own stuff, be selfless and say, you know what, I'm going to step out uh, and help this person. Even if you hear uh, negative things from other people, I don't have time, I'm busy, I don't know what they think this is. And, uh, you know, you hear sometimes people saying that, or, you know, my mother was in a nursing home and nobody visited her, so I'm not going to see this person, or um, I dealt with this and nobody went to, to, to come see me. God is saying, stop it, stop it. Go and be uh, a help. If you're able to help, go and be a help. He is watching, he's looking, he's listening, and he sees. Hallelujah. He sees our heart. He sees the intent of our heart. He sees. And you know, um, you're blessed when you do it. You're blessed when you're able to help people. It ha doesn't have to be something that's so, uh, you know, uh, money or, you know, tangible. It, it can be just of your time, giving of your time, someone that is lonely, someone that uh, elderly person that needs assistance. Maybe, you know, you know, they're living by themselves and just check up on them. You know, you know, call and check up on them. How are you? Are you okay? Is there anything that I can do? You know, um, and don't look at it as a burden. Look at, at, at it as a blessing, as you blessing someone's life, as you adding, hallelujah, the blessings of God, hallelujah, on to your life. Amen. Hallelujah. You're adding a star on your crown. Hallelujah. As you be a blessing to other people's life. Amen. Whatever we can give in this life, we should be willing to give it. And we we should not be questioning uh, or looking at what someone else is doing. Because I'm going to tell you, a lot of people will say, I don't have time. I'm busy. I got things going on over here. You know, and that may be true. But at the end of the day, even though you have times where you know you're very very busy you know i'm busy but at the same time i have a desire and we should all have a desire to do what we can do to help our fellow man our fellow man you know what we can do to help and it doesn't always have to be like i said tangible money uh monetary whatever it, it can be just basically just uh of your time given checking on a person, uh, making sure they're okay. Even if you're out in the store, you see someone that's struggling, you know, just giving a hand, you know, you may say, well, I don't feel like doing, you know, I don't feel like it. I don't, you may not feel like it. You know, it's a lot of times you, you know, I don't even sometimes even pushing myself to get up, to go to work, pushing myself to, to, to do this, to do that. Um, the things that I need for daily life sometimes, but we have to do it if we want to what, maintain we have to do these things um we don't just do it because 
of a feeling. I don't feel like getting up and going to work. I don't feel like doing this. I don't feel like doing it. When we do as unto God, we're doing it for the glory of God, that he gets the glory out of everything that we do. When I come on here and talk to you guys, it's for God to get, excuse me, I'm sorry, guys, I'm holding the phone. It's for you, for God to get the glory out of my life, for him to get the glory. It's nothing of me, me. It's none of my glory, but it's for the glory of God, for the kingdom of God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. So I just wanted to come on and encourage you guys to make sure that we as a body are always keeping our ears open, one, and always having a spirit of, how can I help? If we hear of someone that's in need or we know of someone that's in need, you know, and they need something, uh, you know, for us to go and drop off or do this or do that, you know, and we, we can squeeze it in. Even if we're busy, we can squeeze it in. You know, we can help them. Help them. Because God is watching and he's looking at your heart. Where is that heart at? Where is that? Why uh, can't we do things a lot of times uh, to make time for other people? It's not always about us. It's about other people. You know, sometimes people say, well, uh, you know, I got my kids. I got my grandkids. I got this. I got that. You know, and I'm handling over here. I don't have time. Make time. Make time. In order for us to be blessed and to get to that next level in Christ, we must be selfless and love other people truly as we love ourselves, our children, grandchildren. You know, it's not always about, oh, my, 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 my. It's about what can I do? What can I give to the body of Christ, to the body of Christ? I love you guys. I just wanted to come on real quick and give that quick word that the Holy Spirit gave me to say, you know, um, and keep our eyes open, keep our ears open to where we can plant those seeds and where we can help other people. Cause God is watching us and God is going to bless you as you do it as unto him. Hallelujah. Not to be seen, not for any other reason, no negative motive, but to do it as unto God. God said he's going to bless over and above. Hallelujah. Which you can even ask or think. Amen. So God bless you. Let me have a word of prayer with you. Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for your love. We thank you, Father, Father God, for all that you're doing and all that you're going to do. We thank you and we praise you, hallelujah, for our heart and our mind to give as unto you and to be a blessing in people's lives, Father. We thank you, Father God, that we know without a shadow of a doubt that as we do it as unto you, you are going to bless us pressed down, shaken together, and running over. Men will give unto our bosoms, as your word says. Father, we thank you, oh God, for a mind, to keep a mind of giving and to help other people, to love our neighbors as ourselves. Father, we thank you for the spirit, the right spirit, the right heart at all times. Keep us with a clean heart. Keep us, oh God, with our mind focused on you to do the right thing, hallelujah, and not to follow the uh, mind of of the enemy. We give you praise. We give you glory. We give you honor for who you are and what you're doing in our lives. In Jesus name we pray. Amen and amen. Hallelujah. I love you guys. Be encouraged. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe as well as comment. Let me know how these messages are truly blessing your life. Be sure to hit your notification bell so that you can get every new upcoming video. I love you. Be encouraged. And remember, all week long, let's plant those seeds. Let's help others. Let's be a blessing in other people's lives. I'll talk to you real soon. God bless you.